Hey everyone, this is Manshark Sub LPs. I'm Sub, and this is Stellaris. We are the Panuri Collective, great followers of the Tree of Life. And, um, yeah, we, we are at war, but we'll do that in a moment. So these are our holdings right here, a little bit up here. We do, of course, own the L cluster, and we have a small outpost down here in Unif. Just for, really, just kind of for shits and giggles, to be honest. Um, let's see, the galaxy is a strange and interesting place. We are recovering a little bit after the nanobot swarm came through. Um, we're doing fine. We've actually consolidated all the uh, land that we wanted, or, well, space that we wanted, I guess we could call it. And so now we're just kind of sitting here for a little bit. Um, future expansion plans do include, we might expand out of this. Because this is not actually too bad a little system. We get it to Kudraka. Lock that off and then eventually go to war with the uh, Stakashi Vestige. Vestige. Let's see how that goes. Maybe get that archaeological site finally. But, let's just have a look at our holdings. So over here we've got the Ozcock Citizen Alliance. We're no longer boarded with the Tebrans, interestingly enough. Here we've got these little buffer zones here which might shape up. The Hafka Mercantile Guilds here. Dorblon Enterprises are... Uh, I mean, there's almost nothing of them left, so I don't know what they're doing. Then we've got the United Macro Union here, and the Frubalav Progenitors here. We are at war with the Frubalav Progenitors. We declared that at the end of last episode, um, after we've made claims on all of their systems. These are a fallen empire. Um, they're enigmatic observers, so they're probably not the most normal one for us to go to war with, but fuck it, this is what we've done. You have ceased to amuse your little game. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's manage our population first. We do have an unemployed person on Yultar's Bulwark, so let's just resettle them. We don't actually have the influence to resettle at the moment, so let's ignore that. Um, these places just need more dudes, but Oh yeah, these are the Ringworlds. So the Ringworlds need more of everything. We might as well build them, I guess. It's not really too bad. Alright, up that one. Up that one. It's a bit hard to work out exactly what we want them to have, though. And I think from memory what we actually want to do is we really need the, um, what you call it, the hive core to be upgraded to a hive nexus first so we can get these cool buildings all right we're going to leave that alone for a moment come down here what else do we have this one could use an upgrade volatile moats we've got plenty what else can we give them yeah these guys are waiting on the same sort of thing and i think here as well yeah, they just need more population. A lot of these places are new, so I've got almost nobody in population. So there's going to be a lot of, um, shall we say, backlog. When one was Corinth Station? Is that our main one? Yeah, that's our main one. We might upgrade Corinth Station a little bit. Its defenses are all right, but. Why just make it alright when you can make it better? And uh, we'll hit the upgrade button on that. We're going to get a, about 30 messages about things being upgraded. Yeah, I don't care about most of these. What are you doing, Sherfin Station? Why do you have a spare building slot? Oh, it's that one there. Very nice. Do you have defenses yet? You don't have defenses yet. Right. So you must have just come online properly. One, two. <clears throat> it's early for, early in the day for me, so my uh, mouse clicking isn't exactly on point. Just woke up about half an hour ago. I thought, you know what, I better do some recording. Get some episodes done. Okay, everywhere does have the messages that they're ready to... Um, whoops, get out of that. Ready to upgrade their 
defenses, and we might do that at some point, but it's going to be real annoying when that happens. All right, Hisnax Armada is there, Galifors is there, Olimax is moving in, Ahab is sitting there, it's fine. Ralpikin's already there, Hagahon moving up, and Tyrion is there. And we don't have, ah, uh, we do have a gateway here, right. What was it, was it Galifor? Yeah, Galifor is going to respond. Actually. Do we still have free passage for the United Macro Union? I feel like we do. Alright, Galifor, you're coming here. His snack, you're also coming here. And Ralpican? No, Ralpican's fine where they are. Tyrant. Yeah, there we go. You're also coming here. So they will be one jump away. Let's do it. Get it up to fast speed and go. I want to say, are these guys actually moving around at all, or are they just... Oh, there goes 50k worth of force. That's good. That's basically what I want them to be doing. Nope, oh, nope, the United Macro Union has just closed their borders with us. Dicks. Alright. Get back in the orbit of your, uh... respective stations. <laughs> That is totally alright. We will be able to deal with this with whatever force we've got on hand. Okay, where are you going after this? Looks like they're splitting up. Okay, I'm going to need you to move. They can't get through this line. Borrow Babble will hold them. I mean, they may One of our stations is beset by enemies. do this, the spirits have which is 100% fine. One of our stations is beset by enemies. Because we will take these back, and Space they cannot. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. So now they're just sitting there for the moment. Ah, no, there we go, we're on the move. Heretic fleet engaged. Here we go. Yes. That's why we need a science ship here. Ah, uh, yeah, go One of our stations grab everything. Is beset by enemies. That's fine, science vessel. You are necessary. Are they coming this way? No, they're sort of going down that way. Alright, can you... Have we retaken the station yet? Yep, just did. Wonderful. Get your ass down here. They're moving somewhere. Not 100% sure where. Station engaged. Yeah, it's fine. Lost a destroyer, that's okay. Just keep on coming down, we'll just do a sweep here. Wait for the reinforcements to show up. They're due in about... Yeah, about a hundred days, that's fine. That's one ship. Ah, oh, yeah, battle cruiser. Nice. Very nice. Keep it coming. So, if I've got it right again, yes, they are unable to construct new ships. So, every ship that we destroy here is great. Now, this here implies to me that they're going to try and come around. That's concerning to me, because if they come around, they'll be coming here to Yelbarasta. However, Yelbarasta is tough as hell, so I don't think that's going to be a problem. 
How's the science going? We're just down two destroyers, that is fine. Or are they using the gateway? They're using the gateways. Okay, that's a little bit more concerning because I'd like to know where they're going with those gateways. Ah, up here. Debris analyzed. That's weird. <clears throat> Uh, anyway, we got 10% progress on dark matter deflectors, jump drive, dark matter power, dark matter propulsion, physics research, and engineering research. So if we just go to technology for a second, uh, we'll work that out in a bit. Oh yeah, we should ban the Makaroo from our lands if they've banned us from theirs. Close borders, assholes. That goes for everybody else as well, if I remember right. Yep, closing all these borders. You did this to yourself. Like if they hadn't uh, closed borders on me and made it easier for me to fight this war, maybe I wouldn't be doing this. I would be doing this, but you know. I think that's all of them. Sure. Oh, yep, you're, you're done there, so if you come back down here and do those research projects. Also, they've closed borders back to me, that's fine. Yeah, we've lost a few more destroyers. It's alright. Oh, our Admiral picked up a new skill. Scout. It's not terrible. We actually lost quite a few destroyers. Um, if we could just... Pop back down here and heal up. Cool. They can go there. Where's the other fleet? Oh, that's two of them actually. So Hagahon's Armada can come over to here. Excuse me, guys. They can come over to this way. And then the other one, which is Olamax Armada, can go to Oc Ocopleron. Galapagos Armada doing? Resting. Oh yeah, we've got more um, science to get in there then. Do we have a spare science vessel? I mean, not real. Ooh, what are you doing there? Surveying. Mm. We might have trapped him by accident. Alright, you. Come up here for research. Thank you. Cross Palvin Vida has gotten the deviancy thingy. That's fucking. doesn't matter. We're pretty much beyond the point of managing our planets. Oh, okay, they've come through here. Alright. That's okay. Oh, piracy appeared. Yeah, irritating. The apostates are after our spaceport. <sighs> All right, we'll deal with this then. Are you all healed up yet? Yeah, you are. Ah, oh, that's a really annoying trip. Actually, we should really have put a gateway there. Um, I don't care. I'll let them rampage a bit. It's a distraction for them. 
Where are you going? You are coming down this way? Wonderful. Um, and you, while you're healing up, if we could also reinforce you. Good, all of them from Takarum Station. Debris it's really good. Analyzed. Very nice. I think there's another one there for you to look at. Ooh. A whole bunch of our stuff just expired, so let's have a quick check of it. Um... Yeah, up at all. It's absolutely fine. It's still fine. I mean, I've got more than enough unity, so I'll trigger that anyway. I'll trigger that one too, though it's completely unnecessary. Alright, good stuff. What was that? Oh, we passed uh, the repeal integrated things? Okay, sure. Okay, they've been fully repaired, so now we're just waiting on them to reinforce. Galifor's armada is sitting pretty over here. See, the reason I don't want to start the moving is because... Why can't we go to that one? Do we... Did we oh, we closed borders to the Oscock Citizen Alliance. Of course we did. I'm smart, I swear. Yeah, it's a bit of an annoying one to get to, really. Oh well, we might as well, um, actually, no, we'll leave it for the moment, because if we distract my attention between two things, it's going to get messy, and if we take all this shit, they should just give up anyway. Hopefully. The spirits have granted yeah, us easy new money. Wisdom. Keep it rolling, lads. Alright, so... Yeah, we've got more stuff here so that we can't actually have gotten all already. So, Dark Matter Deflectors. Very good shields, if I remember right. Dark Matter Reactor. Yeah, of course. <laughs> and of course, we did get Jump Drive Progress as well, which I don't particularly want to complete, but whatever. Um, there is a potential that we can finish this shit up ourselves just by... We've got one, two, three, four... Five six, so six by ten percent, ten percent being five thousand. It's going to be well. So we've already got twenty percent done. I'm going to actually wait on those. We're not going to pick any of those just yet because I feel like they're going to get automatically done for us. And it's the same thing down here. We've got dark matter thrusters down here, which are pretty good. Do we have anything else? I think that's basically it. Oh, whatever. But this is the benefit of going to war with a fallen empire. Oh, yeah, I don't care about these. Yes, yes, deviant drones. Every ship they lose. And this is how you would win against them um, in a sort of not an overpowered fight. Like, we are definitely overpowered regarding them. But, what are you doing? Not assisting research, right? But if you were a small, smaller empire, you could technically um, whittle them away because you can always build more ships. They can't. Unless they awaken. And if they awaken, well, um, look, it's on for young and old at that point.
What are you guys actually doing? Nothing at the moment? Just sitting there. Okay, that's cool. Let me come up and see how we go against one of these. The spirits have granted us new We wisdom. should do quite well. Oh, it looks like I turned off automatic shit. Um, no, actually, I want you to just do what I want you to do. I don't want to research that just yet, so... Give me extraction patterns, I guess? Weird. There we go, we got it. We only lost... Two destroyers. We'll sit there for a little bit, see what these guys... Like, if these guys want to move in our way or something like that. Doesn't look like they are. Focusing crystals expired, um, we'll have that back. Let's go down and... Hey, come on, go and take over that battle cruiser. Debris analyzed. Ah, that was Terminal Egress, wonderful. So we're all done there, so you can head back down to Corinth and get on with the assisting research. Excellent. Yeah, they've spread themselves all through here, which is fine by me. I don't really care. If, if we need to, we can go clean that up later. Because at the moment, we're just destroying their shit. Like, yeah, what up? We're here. Nice. Um, you can actually go into Aram. Thank you very much. You are still assisting research. Yep. I can't actually go in into the Macaru space, so these cruisers up here are not helpful for me. Debris analyzed. Okay, that was that one done down in Grumian. There's still more for him. Beautiful. Is there a world in there? Yeah, there is a world in there. Armies, 352. Okay. Was there a world in this one? Yes, there was. 528. Jeez. All right. Well, lads. Um. Could you repair up there? Or do you yes, they can repair there. Beautiful. Also reinforce. How are you doing down here? Are you better yet? You are better. Lovely. Um, I'm going to send them up this way then. You. No, you can't repair there yet. You need another cruiser though. Um, that's something we can get you from local. From Takaram. These forces need to start moving this way. Okay, guys, just get in orbit of the station. Like, come on. It's not hard. There we go, it just regenerated its health, so we should be able to repair them right there. Shelter in place, as they say. And if you look at how the war's doing, we are going very well. Our um, space battle war exhaustion, comparatively, they're at 34%. We could settle the status quo. We're not going to do that. We're going to be achieving our war goals today. Are you all repaired up yet? Not yet. I think you guys are though. Yes, you are. Bombard it. You lads get into orbit. Debris analyzed. You're not going to attack it just yet, but you know. Is that Hagahon's Armada? That was this one? No, it's all the max. Go on, repair. Okay, 
Okay, he's still got one bit of debris left there, then we'll move him up to this one. Okay, these guys are good now. Um, yeah, go blow it up. Actually, you know what? Don't worry about that. Just yet, we've got... Jeez, what are these guys? Cybrax Warforms, yeah, okay. Just land all the armies. Our champions are making planet fall. Look at this, 10,000 versus 200, them. like... Our champions have secured a heathen planet. It was a cool story while it lasted, boys. Alright. Let's head up here. 90k in this station, we should be able to take it. And meanwhile, you can actually come over this way. Yeah, maybe you can leave the transport ships alone until you take the station down, boys. Like, I don't care about their armies. They're not that strong in terms of army force. Okay, there it is. Lost a lot of um, little smaller ships from that, but that's totally fine. I need both of you to come up. Debris oh, did you... They consolidated into one fleet. That's kind of annoying, isn't it? Because I've got like... Now I've got a spare general somewhere, maybe? I don't know. Bit weird. Oh, well, whatever. Yeah, head up here, thank you. Oh, are you done there? You're done there, good. Um, I guess come over to this one. We've got more than enough research sitting around for us to get the... Um, Let's actually check. Yeah, we only need two more. There's so many, so much of it just sitting around the place. This is great. I'm gonna have to do another whole sprue of updating. System survey. We've got plenty of dark matter, so that should actually help us out. Oh yeah, that was a pretty quick one. That one was. Um, I don't know, do I want to... Yeah, might as well just take it. And uh, you can shelter in place and repair, and also repair properly, because that's going to take a little bit of time. Meanwhile, our armies, let's make them... Enter the orbit of Mother. Yeah, see, 18,000, it's not a bad force. I gotta say, there's a lot of dudes there. Um, the issue there is that we have... Cybrex Warforms. Our champions are making planet fall. Now look at that, there's a lot of them. them. We've got just as many, and better. Hopefully they trade out our um, Xenomorph armies before they get too damaged. Yeah. How would you be? You've got all these defensive armies, like we're going to defend our homeland and all that sort of thing. We land Xenomorphs and Cybrex Warforms on you. Just like, oh okay. I see how it is. Giant robot, like... Armies and just... System survey aliens. How could we do it to him? Oh, the Arrakis system. There we go. How lovely. There's a frozen world, a gas giant, and a molten world. That's not what I thought Arrakis was like. Oh, well, good on it. Anyway, back down to the fighting. Our champions have secured a heathen planet. Yeah, they did a good job. Um, that's the capital there. 
I think we can take all of these without any bombardments, to be honest. I, I don't see an issue with it. Oh, look at that. They flew one of their fleets in. Let's fucking go. Our champions are making planet fall. It's a pretty big fleet. Spirits protect them. Yeah, four battle cruisers. A lot of damage on some of those, though. Debris analyzed. Good. Get the next one. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Nice. Yes, it was so close. Like one tap on that, and we'll have it. So let's just go. Oh, heat recyclers? What? Oh, whatever. Did you guys win yet? Or are you still fighting? Still fighting. Not for long. Our champions have secured a heathen planet. And now we take Cradle. This is a big set of armies. I couldn't tell you. Oh, yeah, they've got a bunch of actual, like, Aegis complexes. That's... Our champions are making planet fall. May the spirits protect It's a them. lot of force. But you've got to remember our guys, not only do we have a lot of force, but it's honestly kind of insane. Oh, what are we voting on now? Minor military sanctions. Um, wow, they can actually outvote us. I mean, we'll see. We do have a couple of gene warrior armies. Us new it's not really going to help us. There we go. So we completed analyzing the debris. So now we have dark matter deflectors and dark matter reactors. Very cool. We're going to keep on doing these research projects because there's a lot of them and they're kind of cool. And we'll see how it goes. Okay, let's head up here. Um, I'm going to send both of them, I guess. Just to deal with it. Then we'll take Pash. Yeah, so a bit of a longer fight. We've probably lost a few more army forces, but ultimately this has gone very well. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Cool. Oh, okay. Um, we're against minor administrative sanctions, and we are against the Guardian Angels Act. Okay, cool. Our champions have secured a heathen planet. How about that, lads? How about that? The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Ah, that's one that we have to actually set ourselves. Yeah, so unfortunately we can learn jump drives by accident here. Um, which kind of sucks. So I'm just going to automate the research a bit. Because, look, if it happens, it happens. At this point, yeah, we will unfortunately automatically learn it in a moment or two. Okay, where's that Starfleet going? Back down south, okay. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Just like, yeah, that would be sensible because these might be a little bit too tough for one fleet to take on. Are you moving? You're not moving at all. Um, go. Just take that down. System survey complete. Oh, very nice. Yeah, we've just unlocked jump drives. And Dark Matter Frosters. Very nice. 
after this war, we will have to have a quick look at our um, Did we just lose all of the... Yeah, okay. Must have already unlocked all of those techs or some bullshit like that. Um, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh yeah, see this ring? I believe that's the jump drive thing. It's just popped up. Because science ships automatically upgrade. Maybe. Not 100% on that. Okay, I don't think there's anything for him to do, so I'm going to pop him up to Unith. Just get him in position for later on. While oh, we smash things. Alright, good, you've decided not to come through. Yeah, smart decision. Okay, that's where the army is going. See, what they should have Our done is have been landed their army. Oh, maybe they've actually fixed that. There was an update. Maybe they've actually fixed the annoying, like, repaired, 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 repaired thing. But what they should have done is landed their army on Pash 1. I wouldn't have been able to take it down. And it might have helped out a little bit. Probably not, because their army was trash. Comparatively. But, you know. Okay, yeah, so this champions are making planet fleet here, the, the reason why this has appeared them. here is because it fled a previous battle. So it's respawned at their capital, which is owned by me. And now it's dead. Because it couldn't escape either. Good, some places got terraformed. Lovely, lovely, lovely. <coughs> Our champions have secured a heathen planet. Good work, lads. Uh, I don't think there's any heathen planet there or there. So why don't you come up and take on Tefl? So they've got that 18,000 fleet there. They've got one fleet here, which is 27,000. And I think that's kind of it. Which is a bit normal, I guess. They're at seventy-four percent. We better go and start clearing out those territories. I'm going to send um, Hisnax Armada to do that. It'll take him a while to get there. Looks like a bunch of our ships have auto upgraded. Let's just have a quick look at that. So Corvette. Yeah, those are definitely auto upgrades there. So Dark Matter Deflectors installed, Dark Matter Thrusters installed. How better are they than the other ones? So 75% plus 15, 125% plus 20. Great. And the Dark Matter Reactor as well. Um, oh, that's actually useful. 220 versus 285, and we've only got plus 16 surplus. So yeah, that's actually been very useful for us. Um, I can't... Let's see, hide obsolete components. There we go. So Dark Matter Deflectors versus Hyper Shield. So look, let's look at the large ones. 870 and 8.7. 1, 1,1101 and 11.1. Yeah. Clearly a superior item. Let's just make sure that they all upgraded. Looks like it. We're just going to check the Deflectors Shields. Because that's really all we need to def check there. Yeah, everything got upgraded. That's beautiful. That's absolutely beautiful. These guys probably didn't need the... Oh yeah, you can put the jump drive on. Um... It does technically make it a lot easier for them to get between hyper lanes, but I don't care that much, and it doesn't really increase speed. Yeah, we could have technically gotten away with a zero point reactor instead of a dark matter reactor, but we've got plenty of dark matter. We have been saving it up. So, you know, what of it?
Yeah, they're not willing to concede yet because we are demanding unoccupied systems, planets, and so on. Once we occupy the planets, I don't see too much of an issue, and that's literally what we're doing right now. Our champions are making planet fall. May the spirits protect them. They will never be able to stop us. Our champions have secured a heathen planet. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure that this won't matter, but I'm sending a fleet round just in case. More terraforms, lovely. So that must mean that our truce has expired with these losers. Cool. Very cool. Our champions are making planet fall. May the spirits protect them. It's not going to take them too long. What did you guys lose? A couple of cruisers. Our Surely that's on the way. Have secured a heathen planet. Right? No? Okay. Alright, you guys are done there. Let's head down to this one and take it. And that... At the end of the day, System will be survey it. Complete. Yeah, look at that. Minus 33. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. As soon as we take this planet, it's all over. Let's get... Um, his snack back to where he should be. He's not needed. So we should just be able to return to base him. Oh yeah, there you go. See, so there's the initiate jump order. If we had jump drives installed on every ship, um, they would just be able to do it. It'd take a bit of a penalty for 200 days. So you can't just jump them in, unfortunately. Are they returning? Yeah, return to home base. Our champions are making planet fall. May the spirits protect them. They're all good. It'll be fine. There's a lot of stations that we're going to have to scrap a few of. And unpause the game, of course. Our champions have secured a heathen planet. There. They will automatically accept it. As well they should. They are 100% occupied. We are going to send the offer. The ancient precursor state of Fribulov Progenitors has met its final demise at the hands of its enemies. What the fall of this once great empire will mean for galactic politics remains to be seen. Oh you foolish foolish Panuri, this could have been avoided if only you had allowed us to guide you. Now look at what you have done. The Hive expands. Okay, pause the game. You lads, you're still a force to be reckoned with. Um, I am going to keep you in the area. We do have 48 or 49 star bases at this point. Um, what do we got here? Oh, this is pretty pathetic. Um, no, not dismantle. I want to change it to a hangar bay. And I want these ones to be changed to missile bays. And what else do we have here? I don't want crew gestation chambers. I want... We're not going to hold this one for too long, actually. This one here. So I'm not going to change any of these just yet. This one here we're going to do the same thing with. So we need another hangar bay and two missile batteries. Rest of that, whatever. This one here, well, they've had a, they had a really standard uh, loadout, didn't they? Um, we're going to get rid of Irem. And we're going to get rid of Yunar. Because eventually we're going to be taking all of this. So these won't actually matter. Um, I'll get rid of Tefl here as well. 
Okay, cool. Let's terraform that one, why not? Alright, we have got a lot of very strange stuff to do right now because um, we just took a lot of land. So, first things first, where are the Frubalavs? Here they are. How are you, gentlemen? You are being assimilated, I believe. Well, that's very nice. Um, let me just apply this template to everybody. Situation log updated. If we do that and then we assimilate them, it's probably going to be a little bit easier for us. Oh wow, not much stuff here, huh? No tree of life. Well, you need a tree of life, guys. And then I guess you're going to need... What's undesirable here? Oh, we've got a couple of synthetics. Okay, that's... That makes sense. That's fine. That's fine. Hmm... Interesting. I mean, what can we get these guys to even do? Like, alloys? We are going to be running a bit of an energy credit issue for a moment, or five, because uh, assimilating takes time and money. Yeah, let's get the clone vats up. I guess the energy grid, why not? Ah, mode harvesting traps, very nice. Yeah, planetary supercomputer could be nice. Spawning pools too. Um, yeah, some synaptic nodes. And I'm gonna guess... Research labs. And I'm gonna want one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. And why not some of them? Sure, done. Okay, so that was Pash 1. Now we'll have a look at Irem. There was one planet here, the Preserve, a nice Gaia world. Can't be a Gaia world unless you've got a Tree of Life, boys. Come on. It is a very nice planet, actually. <coughs> Spawning pools and the other thing, clone vats. Yeah, I kind of feel like they're not going to make as much use out of... Yeah, they're not, not really all that big at the moment, so let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And you can have one, two, three. And I guess we'll make one, two, three. Four, five, six. Yeah, all right. And over here, um, whew, good question. Mineral purification plants, of course. Might as well put down an energy grid. Did I put down any alloy stuff? I did. Ah, oh, they're full anyway. That's good. Back out of that, we'll go into Una. This one's a bit more annoying. There are a ton of them here. Wow. Wow, there's some stuff here that... Um, It's let us take. What's this? Class 4 Singularity. Repair it. Class 4 Singularity. Repair it. Dimensional Fabricator. Yeah, repair it. Autoforge. Repair it. Autoforge. Repair it. Then they've basically got a whole lot of hive districts. And a whole lot of synthetics. Jeez. Have a tree of life. Now what about brother? Brother has an auto forge, repair that. Oh, it's also got some some things already up and running, that's very nice. Um, you need a tree of life, of course. And probably clone vats and the 
Oh yeah, one of them. Where's the spawning pool? There it is. We don't need auto curating vaults. You make a lot of minerals already. Do you already have? Yeah, have one of them. Cool. Then mother. Obviously. Whoop. No. Mother needs a tree of life. And we need to repair. Oh, we don't actually need to repair that one. That one's bad for us. So let's get rid of that. The affluent center doesn't matter to us. Because it produces consumer goods. Who gives a shit about consumer goods? Not me. It's this one. Another affluent center and two nourishment centers? Absolutely, we'll have those back. But the affluent center is not needed. Oh, Bavarian power plant. Yeah, have one of them. Very nice. Okay, back out of there. Tefl up here has a planet. Very nice. Needs a tree of life. Clone vats and spawning ponds. Pools, whatever. Loads, and then you can have the rest of them just be industrial districts, that is fine. Um, tch -tch -tch -tch. Yeah, it's probably alright. We're not really going too hard on the min maxing here. Oh, a couple of those actually, yep, very nice. Then what? Yeah, maybe more alloys? Sure. Alloy foundries, energy grid. Some more exotic gases, and I guess... I didn't actually put down any of those, so we can get rid of that. That's not... That was a bad pick. Um, resource processing center. That's good. One more, guys. Asterius free. Again, this is going to be industrial districts all over the place. Sure, makes sense. Okay. He's going back somewhere, I think. Yeah, he's going to be necessary anyway, so we'll just keep him there. He's fine. Um, Ralbican, where do you normally stay when you're at home? Takaram Station. Okay, you are our navy for this area. Um, but I do need you to go back home for the moment. Like, everybody should be going back home. All of you. I only need one army to hold, one navy to hold these guys off. Now, Galifor's armada up here. Uh, you need to be upgraded. So please do that. Tyrion's armada over here. You also need to be upgraded. So please do that. Ah oh, man, they're all going to the same place. It's going to take forever. Anyway, we just beat one of the Fallen Empires, so that's cool. Um, can I get this? I need a construction ship. You, maybe? You! You're not doing anything. Get up here. You're also not doing anything. Neither are you. Or you. Or, uh, you're kind of doing something, I guess. Maybe. Kind of. Alright, we've got 600 influence, guys, so let's start making some claims. Um, of course, the most... the easier claims... Gonna be... 
Let's see. One, two, three. That one cost a bit too much. I don't care too much about that. Make those claims. Thank you. Go away. Make claims. One, two, three. How much is that? Oh, only a hundred. That's fine. Yeah, they cost a bit more, and there's actually something on them, which sucks. But you know, what can you do? Yeah, I guess we'll claim that one. Make those claims. Thank you very much. Ah, so the next war, I basically want to take all of this. <laughs> um, I basically want to take this whole section. And if we can get away with it as well, this section here. And Imithin. Imithin would actually be very nice to take, because that's where we keep getting attacked from. Species tampered with. Oh, thank May you very much. Forgive us. Let's have a quick look, Fribilavs. Wonderful, and they're all scheduled for assimilation, which is good. Hang on. Why do they care as... Oh no, our amenities are fine, amenities are fine. I mistook them for uh, consumer goods for a bit. Uh, anyway, um, it's good to have you on board, um, you former fallen empire, superior race, etc, etc, etc. It's good to System have you. System survey complete. Oh yeah, that does actually remind me we can set up a new... Uh, actually, let's see. One, two, three, four. There's nothing in Akamar. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we'd leave out Teffel. But one of these two are going to be our new capital, I think. What are you doing? Sitting there doing nothing. Sounds about right. Can you go up there and survey it at least? Yes, I do want to take this area here. That's why we move the construction vessel up. But at the moment, I think claims are more important to be making because we, I think we are able to go to war with the Federation again. So that's the plan. Yeah, I don't think it's too bad a plan. System survey complete. They're just going to be getting steadily more pissed off at us. But the thing is, our forces are about to get even more upgraded. Oh yeah, you guys actually need a new destroyer and upgrade. So, what were they at? Almost 200,000. So 198,000. And we'll see what it's like once they finish the upgrade. Although actually this one might be a better one to go with. Where are you, Hisnack? You're up there? Oh, you're going to be one of those ones who jump back here to repair. Yeah, you can wait. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. The spirits have granted us new wisdom. Did I tell this one to automate? Yeah, I did. That's fine. Continue. Just wish there was a quicker way for us to get influence. Normally you do that by like rivaling people and that sort of deal. But uh, it's a little tough for us because we're so big. Which admittedly is like, that's basically working as intended, you know. Because it's like, well once you get big enough you shouldn't have as much ability to expand. 
and that's where things come from. But yeah, this has been a very good, uh, very profitable little exercise for us today. Um, however, we're going to have to leave it there. So in the meantime, I've been Sub, you've been yourselves. Later.